Welcome to Travels Unfiltered. Today we are highlighting the top 18 local and authentic foods, dishes, and meals to try in the Maldives. For more travel tips make sure to subscribe to our channel. Starting off at number 18 we recommend Cream Jehi Banners. Cream Jehi Banners translates to bun with cream and is exactly that. The cream is made with icing sugar and condensed milk and the amount of cream you put on your bun is completely your decision. But for us, the more cream, the better. This makes for a great sweet snack, perfect for afternoon tea. Coming in at number 17 we recommend bajia. Bajia is one of the most famous snacks in the Maldives. Bajia is a triangular-shaped snack which is spicy. It is cooked using valomas aka smoked fish or canned tuna and includes a variety of spices. It is then wrapped in dough and deep-fried. For the best bajia, we highly recommend heading to a small stall called Husnuj in Malay. Husnuj has a huge reputation for selling the best bajiyas, and every evening you'll see a long queue of Maldivians waiting to buy bajiyas from Husnuj. Coming in at number 16 we recommend fish curry. Fish curry is one of the most common curries in Maldives. Traditionally, a paste of various spices will be made by crushing and rolling different types of chilies. Fish curry is often eaten with roshi, Maldivian flatbread, in the morning and with rice for lunch and dinner. Fish curries vary in taste and thickness across the different parts of the Maldives due to the areas using different types of fish. One of the versions of fish curry, and one of our favorites, is gola riha. This is cooked specifically in the Lamu Atoll region. Coming in at number 15 we recommend fried yams. Yams are one of the most popular popular crops grown in the Maldives and as a result, fried yams are extremely popular in the Maldives. They have a fantastic texture, being crunchy on the outside and moist on the inside. They are also served with sauces that make the experience worth the try. Coming in at number 14 we recommend masfan. Masfan is one of the easiest and delicious dishes to make. This dish is made with canned tuna, fresh coconut milk, onion, lemon, and chili. It is usually eaten in conjunction with rice, but other sides include smoked fish. Masfin which is a mixture of dried chili and fish, and dried leaves. Coming in at number 13 we recommend garadilla. Garadilla is one of the most important traditional Maldivian foods and is loved and enjoyed by almost every Maldivian. It's a super simple dish which involves cooking tuna in stock for a few minutes and is basically a fish soup. However, Maldivians rarely eat it as soup, and instead have it with rice and roshi. It also has a reputation for improving in flavor when it is reheated over a few days. Side dishes such as lon Myris, a paste of crushed chilies, fried fish, and fried leaves are commonly eaten with it. Coming in at number 12 we recommend Mars Honey. Mars Honey is one of the trademark Maldivian breakfasts, and translates to fish coconut, which as you guessed it, are the two main ingredients of this dish. The fish used for Mars Honey is the canned tuna produced in the Maldives, and is then often combined with onion, lemon, and chili. Mars Honey comes in a range of different flavors though, and many Maldivians even like to add boiled thora aka sponge gourd, or baraboa aka pumpkin. We highly recommend trying this dish out in the West Harbour area in Malé, now known as Ravaribe Maison, as it has many small restaurants on a strip which serve delicious and traditional Maldivian breakfast dishes. Coming in at number 11 we recommend Masbai. Masbai is a traditionally rich dish and is often eaten on picnics on the beach or on visits to nearby islands. Its yellow colour comes from the yellow spice, rindu, and includes unground pepper giving it a unique flavour. Masbai is often eaten with rihar kuru and dried leaves, raw chilies, and onion. Coming in at number 10 we recommend boshi mishuni. Boshi mishuni, also known as banana flower salad, is a mixture of crunchy, shredded banana flowers and fresh coconut. It also has curry leaves, turmeric, cumin, spices, lime and Maldivian chili to give it a more sweet and tangy twist. This is not an ordinary salad and is more like a salad crossed with salsa. To try boshi mishuni we recommend heading to the crystal sand in Marfushi. Coming in at number 9 we recommend Kali Boki Bar. Kali Boki Bar, also known as fish cake, is one of the must-try Maldivian foods. It's cooked on special occasions in Maldivian homes but is also easily found in many cafes across the Maldives. The cake itself is made of smoked tuna, scraped coconut, onions, and ground rice. We recommend giving it a try at Salathai Cafe in Malé. Coming in at number 8 we recommend Bondabai. Bondabai is one of the more traditional dishes that fills Maldivians with nostalgia as it is another dish which is almost always cooked on special occasions. It is rice steamed with sugar, rose syrup, and pandan leaf. Although it's a sweet dish, it's mostly paired with a spicy chicken or beef gravy. Traditionally, Bondabai was cooked with long grain rice, however, it is much more common in today's day and age for basmati rice to be used. 
closed. Coming in at number 7, we recommend reef fish cutlets. Reef fish is an extremely popular food in the Maldives. The Tandoor Masala Spiced Reef Fish Cutlet is one of the best and most popular meals, and it is often served with coconut and mint chutney, papaya, and cucumber. We recommend trying this dish out at Sea Fire Salt at Anantara Digu. Coming in at number 6, we recommend Kulhimus. Ask any Maldivian what their favorite dish is, and many will tell you Kulhimus is their go-to favorite. Kulhimus is most often made with yellow fin tuna, a variety of spices, including Hanakuri Havardu, toasted spice, and Lonamiris Havardu, chili spice. It is mixed with gravy and commonly prepared as a breakfast dish, served with either roshi or rice. Coming in at number 5, we recommend Gulab Jamun. This popular Indian delicacy is extremely famous in the Maldives and is a must-try delicacy. The dessert is prepared with milk-solid-based balls which are dipped in sugar syrup until they are spongy and soft. Ideally served hot, this is the ultimate dessert with some gulab jamuns being stuffed with dried fruits and cardamom. We recommend trying this dessert at Tandoori Flames in Hulamale. Coming in at number 4 we recommend Rihar Kuru. Rihar Kuru aka fish paste is another very famous traditional dish in the Maldives. It is often paired with roshi and rice and has greatly infused flavors. Rihar Kuru is a time-consuming dish as it is a mixture of tuna in water and salt which is continuously stirred on low heat for hours until it becomes a thick dark paste. Maldivians like to eat Rihar Kuru together with some other local side dishes including fried fish, fried leaves, coconut milk and more. To try Rihar Kuru, we recommend heading to the Jazz Cafe in Malé. Coming in at number 3 we recommend Biskemia. Biskemia is similar to a samosa and a spring roll. It is a pastry which is filled with a mix of tuna and hard-boiled egg, sliced onions and gently sautéed, shredded cabbage. It is often paired with a range of sauces which bring in some delicious flavors, making it a must-try food in the Maldives. Due to the popularity of biskemia, you can find these in many of the cafes in Malé and Hulalmail. Coming in at number 2 we recommend gulha. Gulha is a common Maldivian snack which is made of wheat or rice flour dough filled with tuna tuna fish, chopped onions, coconut, and chilies. They are similar to dumplings with a crunchy fried outer shell and soft inner filling. Some chefs even add turmeric, lime juice and chopped curry leaves into the filling mixture. Gulha makes for a delicious evening snack and can be enjoyed with tea and coffee. Finally at number 1 we recommend Aluvi Boki Bar. Aluvi Boki Bar aka cassava coconut cake is one of the most delicious foods on this list. It is a sweet cassava and coconut cake which melts in your mouth and takes you to dessert heaven. This is a local delicacy which is enjoyed by both locals and tourists making it a key part of the food culture in the Maldives. We recommend trying it at Fine Bake by Susie in Marfushi. All of these foods are a must try. To find out where to source these delicious dishes head to the links in the description box of this video. If you're traveling to the Maldives and need more travel advice, like what to do or where to stay, then make sure you check out our Maldives playlist. Link is also in the description box below. With this video almost over it's time to ask you, what foods will you be trying on your visit to the Maldives? And make sure to leave your recommendations for us in the comment section below. As always, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more travel tips and give this video a like if you enjoyed it. See you next time.